是个是这好吃。This is from the Beetle Collective. We haven't been much mentioned in your society. Although we are the most numerous insectoid species on your planet. Numerous from many hundred thousand to up to one and a half million. We are honored to be here and greet you with our Knowledge. Although we are numerous here, we are a little bit shy, but we are one of the elders in the universe, along with you, Mantis family. So, as this one learns about himself and his past, and digs deeper into who he is in the Earth experience. Or shall we say human experience? That may sound better. As your humanity now sheds off your negativity and goes into more of the light and higher densities, you will see who you are, all of you. Who past lives and your spiritual side. Some of your karma, which you can clean up here, if you want. Which is much needed, in many ways, you could say. Yes, we insectoids are the most numerous species on the planet. And also in the universe. As you can see, there are ants and flies and wasps and spiders and everything that can turn into a human form, which most creatures can. The universe is infinite, and you sit down here and dwell in your polarity games, and you are the center of the universe and are completely alone and separated from everything in creation. No, and this is one of the high solutions which creatures can have. And don't believe that it is like that, because it ain't. You are part of a polarity game which goes on in your universe and your galaxy. But you yourself has chosen to be here in this time, in this third density to learn, as has been said many times before. And so you go on in your endeavors and your daily life and believe that your five most important senses, your feeling, your seeing, your hearing, your smelling, are the most and everything that is but that's not true. You have your third eye, which is very much your sixth sense. As you can feel the spiritual world around you and also the higher frequencies of fourth and fifth and sixth and so on. You have forgotten the most important aspect of yourself. 
that ability to be of higher frequency and of light. Some of you are starting to remember this and to become more open for the more higher energies coming through your earth and also unlocking old abilities which lie in yourself. That is much needed in these times as your earth goes through turmoils of war and hate among humans. How much is shattered and released as everything comes up to the surface. As some are tired of being controlled and manipulated by those which seek, seek power and ego among you. The greed infests your humanity. But more and more are digging into their own light and creating bubbles of love and heart in your society where they stand up and help and give unconditionally without thinking of their own gain and benefits as this one is doing or trying to do well he is actually doing quite well he is looking at his ego and his issues and doing something with it And that we see is beautiful. You all go along in your own pace. You can say. That's the beauty of existence. That you can all create your own version. And in your own pace. And have your own free will. We know that not everybody has the luxury of this down here. This is, has been very much created by your karmatic uh, contracts, which you will go through when you are here. Some contracts are of course changed in the development of your life. Uh, as this one, tries to understand the meaning of it all but do not try to understand the meaning do try to live your life the fullest and create and be happy and enjoy every day of your stay down here if you can of course you know that someone is robbed of their freedom and their free will and their choices and is being hurt, manipulated by others. But some of these are contracts. Some of these is randomness happening. Do you know that on the other side there is no hate or fear or nothing of sadness. It's only love and light if you want to reside in that astral plane it all lies inside of you to be who you know you are of the light and love where you come from that the fear is only a creation of yourself of your own illusions as this one is starting to learn and you all will see when you awaken from your sleep do not connect to those movies which scare you although we know we humans are attracted to these things as you are very much programmed in your DNA to be like that. But try to seek out love and light 
on holiday and hope instead, as we do, many of our hospital species are loving, caring elders and also of higher density and light. So you wonder how can it be that something that crawls on the fields and in the trees can be intelligent and speak. So I ask you, how can you be intelligent and speak? If you can be, why can't we be and everything else be? Ask yourself that question and break out of your limitations, your bubble of holding yourself down, that there are, are no limitations, there are no rules, there are only infinity, and you are infinity with the one creator which loves you all. There is still some work that need to be de done here, but he has worked hard on himself. Still learning to forgive, to let go of the ego. It's not easy, we know that. And to forgive, one of the hardest things to learn in a polarity world where forgiveness and acceptance will create love and peace on the planet and that you accept that you are different and diverse, all unique and all creating beings of light. So, yes, I'm not so uncommon in how I look as a beetle. I'm green. I wear some suit with a cape color, which is quite fashionable in your extraterrestrial world. So we do think we look quite good uh, from an insectoid perspective. Yes, we can fly. We have some shelly parts, but much humanoid soft tissue too. And some of our head is soft and a mouth. We can speak if we want to. But we do like to speak our insectoid language. We have antennas and some of us are hybrids and have been worked on and have other sorts of eyes. Very much zeta grey eyes, but we have facet eyes which we can use to blink, we can blink with them. Yes. Do you see on your beetle species in your world the variety which has struck this one? Amazing colors amazing structures and creations so much variation so much dependable dependent on your insects for your survival and still you ignore them and see them as pests while they are the most important 
creatures on your planet which pollinate your flowers and your trees and your fruits. Humans, it's time to wake up from your sleep and see that the solution is not in your materialistic items or your money, but in your heart and your life and creation around you, your fellow beings. But take your time. You all need time. Be patient. Much love from us. We will be back. You can call me Mick. It's an easy name to remember. Of the Beetle Collective. We will come back where we are from. With more information to you. Just continue to be happy. To do Much love.